Hello everybody, Garden State Aviation here back with another video. In today's video we are going to be doing yet another unboxing. Uh, I believe in this box there is uh, one model. Um, I think it's the Alaska on Goes to Serve, um, but I don't know for sure, so don't quote me on that. But uh, anywho, let's get started. Um, I believe this came from, I ordered the Alaska on Goes to Serve from uh, that guy's airplane, so I believe, whoa, uh, I believe that is the model, um, but I still don't know for sure, but anywho, this, you have this paper thing, and then here is, um, yeah, yeah, it's the last gone English to serve, um, this is the, um, Ay ay ay. Um, this is the NG Models Alaska On and Goes to Serve uh, 737 uh, 800. Now, um, I got this model uh, for Newark, uh, Alaska Fly 737 900s and 700s to Newark. Um, but I just, just decided to get this one uh, the substitute for the Alaska 737 um, 900. Uh, this I'm gonna be using this for Newark updates. Um, so first, before we open the model, we have to look at the box. Uh, so looking at the box, we have um, Boeing 737-800. You have this uh, Alaska Airlines salutes those who serve right here. Alaska Airlines salutes those who serve. Uh, you have. It's a very Star Spangled Banner theme. It's a very American theme thing. Uh, uh oh, uh, it's a very American theme thing. Uh, you have the stripes. Uh, you have the clip art of the model, uh, red, white, and blue, and the Alaska man. That, that's what I just call him. It's I just call him the Alaska man. And then the bottom you have Alaska, uh, the registration which is November five seven zero Alpha Sierra. Uh, and of course you have the Boeing trademarks one to four hundred. Uh, I forgot what it says. One to four hundred scale collectible models. Uh, on the side, you have uh, the uh, NG models logo, Boeing 737-800. Uh, the clip out of the aircraft registration, November 5700 Alpha Sierra. Side, just the Alaska logo. So it's basically the same as this side. Uh, and then here, wow, this looks really interesting. Uh, you have uh, the American f um, stars, uh, white stars. Uh, NG, once again, you have the clip out of the aircraft, Boeing 737-800 on the back. Um, it's basically the same as the front, except with all the um, information, uh, liability information. But yeah, uh, without further ado, let's open the box. This is a highly anticipated model, uh, but wow, NG really do package these models hard. Uh, okay. And this is the model. Wow, this looks really good. Uh, of course, it's the normal NG737 tray. You got all this stuff. Uh, but this model looks fantastic. Um, this model looks really, really well done. Oh, wow. You have this... I keep calling this foam. It's this plastic wrap. Um, ah! Okay, but anywho, here is the model. Um, it does not look damaged at all. Um, it looks really, 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 really nice. Uh, it's not damaged at all. All the landing gear comes intact, and yeah. So now uh, let's uh, start the detail section. So there's a lot to cover in this detail segment, so I think we should get started. Uh, but anywho, starting off the detail segment, we have the cockpit windows, uh, Alaska on and goes to serve seal, uh, floor landing gear, L1 door, tiny Wi-Fi thing, uh, gray Alaska titles, on and goes to serve in blue. Uh, these are blue titles. This is, I think it's Times New Roman, uh, looking at it, but I'm gonna have to check about that. Um, you have the blue engines, you actually have these, um, it has these yellow stripes, actually. That That's very interesting. My camera can't zoom in further, uh, so I'm gonna have to show you guys real far, but it has these yellow sort of stripes. You have this uh, red line here. 
Uh, you have uh, white line that's supposed to represent the stripes on the American flag. Uh, you have the emergency exits. Uh, split scimitars, which are painted American flag themed. And you have this blue hunk in the back. Um, this big, big blue hunk in the back. Uh, you have the registration, which is November 570 Alpha Sierra AS. Uh, November 570 AS and 570 AS. Uh, the American flag and the El Tudor and then of course you have the marvelously uh, Marvelously well done uh, Alaska man. I just call him the Alaska man. I have no idea what he's called in real life um, And then if I didn't say it before you have the um, uh, Amer uh, American flag themed split scimitars and as a bonus you have the uh, these antennas which are the same as on my uh, United 737-800, except they're in white. And on the bottom of the fuselage, I don't know if you guys can see this. On the bottom of the fuselage, um, you have uh, blue painted landing gear. Uh, and then, as usual, as per usual, on the um, forward of the aircraft with the forward landing gear, you have the E-top. I believe it's an E-top's rating. Uh, comment down below if I'm wrong. And then... On the other side, really the only thing different on the, um, only thing different on the other side is just, uh, the, uh, this, uh, cargo door. But other than that, the model is very well done. Um, everything about it just screams this is good quality. Um, now I was gonna get, uh, the Gemini Jets, uh, on and go to serve. Um, I was thinking about getting it for quite a while for Newark, but I decided to wait for NG, and eventually that paid off. Two months later, they released it. Um, but this is a very nice model. I can't stop umming and awing. This is just phenomenal. And of course, everything comes intact, came intact. Um, and uh, NG did fix uh, the problem. There was this problem with their 737s. Um, with the, um, there was a problem with the, whatchamacallit, landing gear where the plane would be facing down like this. Uh, but I do believe they fixed that. And of course, unlike Gemini, the wings, um, are level. But overall, this is a phenomenal model. Uh, and of course, the reason why I got it was for Newark. Uh, Alaska do fly to Seattle and San Francisco, I believe, from Newark. Uh, using a 737-900 and 700. Uh, I couldn't get my hands on a 900. Uh, the 700 I want to buy, and I'm probably going to buy in a few weeks. Uh, so this is just um, part of my Newark fleet now. And that does conclude the detail segment. So my final thoughts on this model is that this is a phenomenal model. And I do think that you Alaska collectors or uh, collectors who fly to um, destinations... Uh, that Alaska flies to using a 737, you guys should get this because this is a very awesome, phenomenally well done model by NG. Just everything about it screams quality. And that does conclude this unboxing video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss my videos, and comment down below if you're going to get the model, what you thought of my video, and what you think about NG overall. Once again, thank you for watching today's video, and I'll see you in the next video. As always, goodbye.